My name is Lorna O'Brien and I'm the head technician here at the Royal Terrell Museum. My job is to take care of the field and preparation programs here at the museum. So everything that involves going out to collect the specimens, bringing them back to the museum and making sure that they're prepared out and brought to our collection storage. Uh, for the Cenozoic, uh, we worked a lot on the cast material, so we had a lot of material that was previously in the gallery that needed to be refurbished to go back out on display. Um, also making sure that any specimens that required additional preparation were taken care of. Uh, we had other casts that had touch-ups and then also taking care of uh, some of the new material that we needed to acquire for the exhibit. One of the most interesting things for me in this exhibit was our use of 3D technology. So this uh, was a prime example of utilizing new technologies to create something that we wouldn't otherwise have had on display. So for example, there were vole teeth and horse jaws that were from other institutions and too delicate to cast in a traditional manner. We were able to get photogrammetry models and CT models of those, 3D print them, and then those 3D print models were painted as exact replicas and are now out on exhibit. So one of the things I really like that they've done in this exhibit is uh, that introduction to that transition between the Cretaceous and the tertiary boundary. Uh, so we finally have a space that tells you how the majority of dinosaurs went extinct and what animals survived through that extinction event, and it's done in a really beautiful artistic way.